Hi Van Dwellers, it's Corinne from New York City. So today we're going to talk about homelessness and does living in a van make you homeless? See, that word seems to be controversial in today's society. Homeless, like, oh, that is such a fucking horrible thing if you're homeless. Like, people often say that, um, oh, they were homeless for, for two months. I was living in my car for two months and I had a bunch of stuff piled up in the windows and I'm just so glad to have gotten out of that because it was a horrible experience. That's what people say when, you know, you when they hear the word homeless. And to me, like, okay, they're associating homeless with living in a car and I live in my car. I don't consider myself homeless, but at the same time, I don't think homeless should necessarily be a bad word. It, you know, it's not necessarily a bad thing. Like, you know, I'm living the life. So whatever you call it, homeless, van dwelling, boondocking, I'm living free. And a lot of people can make the best out of their situation. You know, you got, you're living outdoors, you got this fresh air, um, you know, you get to commune with nature and you're not so reliant on electronics and money. So, you know, who cares if somebody calls you homeless? If you're homeless, you have more access to, you know, government assistance and, um, you know, you're just not wasting your money on, like, drugs and alcohol like some of these people. Well, I mean, see, that's another stereotype with homeless people, you know. People never give their money to homeless people because they say, oh yeah, they're just gonna waste it on booze and drugs. Well, that's not the case, you know. Have you ever been starving? Have you ever been, you know, wondering how you're gonna get your next meal? Um, so yeah, homeless, um... Yeah, also, van dwellers should not think that we're, like, so much better than homeless people. Don't, um, you know, make fun of them. Don't think that you're above them just because you have a roof over your head. Uh, and I also don't want people who are living in houses, sticks and bricks, to be thinking that they're better than car dwellers or calling us homeless. And, you know, what is homeless anyway? The definition of homeless, you know, like, living in you know, not living anywhere, you know, not having a roof over your head, not having a home. Well, I have a home. See this, there's my roof right there and this is my home. I may not have a shower or a big screen television, but you know, I still got the comforts of home. I still got my, uh, my coffee and my bed and you know, that's all you really need. So don't worry about the whole social stigma of being homeless people. Uh, there's worse things in this world than being homeless and um, you don't have to really live like a homeless person either. I mean, even if you are living in your car or your van, you can still get showers, you can still cook meals. Um, I mean, what the hell is with this, all this homeless stigma? Um, so no, I don't think living in a van makes you homeless, but at the same time, if, you know, you get called homeless a lot by the government and stuff and by people, so what? Embrace it. Just, you know, be, I'm homeless and I'm proud. I'm homeless by choice. And that's the only way to live. So, yeah, that's it for today. Peace out.